Okay, here's a message for racists. Um, if you uh, had your worst nightmares come true and black people took over and Asians and Africans, just say Northern Africans, <laughs> Northern African non-Albinos took over and they, they decided to move on in. <laughs> Where we can tell you about it here in Kensington because we have the wonderful Notting Hill. Madonna will tell you about what Notting Hill is like and, and Julia Roberts, you, you probably like those people in Hollywood. Um, I have friends there too. Hi Hollywood, love you. Anyway, the thing is, um, if the worst came to the worst, uh, like it has in America, you'd have someone like Obama, the big bad black man. Well, look at him. He's unhappy, isn't he? W look at his family. There's a happy lady there and happy children, happy Christian family who are tolerant of other religions and try to make friends with other religions. And I think that's the most sensible thing to do, don't you? The only thing I don't agree with Obama on is the, um, the socialism communism thing. I think he should get into the libertarian socialism side like we have in Brittany and Cornwall and uh, in some of our places that people don't always understand politics in the UK. I'm afraid they, we were dumbed down somewhat by Labour Party here. And um, although they're well-meaning and good-hearted people, the Labourites, they, um, they're, they're, just not, they're just not understanding of the finer things in life. They, it's usually younger people or people who haven't travelled much or or not understanding of what identity actually means. So when I, I went to university and studied identity and was looking at some of the creation of ghettos and things, and I was very alarmed at seeing some, um, what seemed to me like Nazi um, creation of ghettos in the north of England, and it really freaked me out, for black kids mainly. It seemed that the... Uh, and check this out for the sake of history. D check out my submissions to the Open University. I didn't like copying in stuff, and I was ordered to copy stuff uh, that wasn't mine and promote stuff that wasn't mine. But essentially what it was doing is it was promoting the building of ghettos in the north of England. I didn't like that. So I take an active interest in the north of England. I have friends at the Daily Mail. And um, I think it's very important, and I'm a big fan of Northern Soul and Northern Soul dancing. Check it out. And um, we should all, all get, get into that. It's, it's get into making new soul music because Northern Soul is uh, an ongoing thing. We still have championships and stuff in the north of England, and it would be nice to see some new soul, uh, new cutting edge and uh, soul. It doesn't have to be huge or commercial because Northern Soul uh, is its own market and um, it is a wonderful thing. It would be nice to have some new Northern Soul. Anyway, uh, just so you know, um, have a think on what I said because Mr. Racist, you're dodo.